In mathematics, steinhaus moser notation is a notation for expressing certain extremely large numbers. It is an extension of Steinhaus's polygon notation. Definitions A number n in a triangle means n n. A number n in a square is equivalent to the number n inside n triangles, which are all nested. A number n in a pentagon is equivalent with the number n inside n squares, which are all nested, etc. n written in n sided polygon is equivalent with the number n inside n nested m sided polygons. In a series of nested polygons, they are associated inward. The number n inside two triangles is equivalent to n n inside one triangle, which is equivalent to n n raised to the power of n n. Steinhaus only defined the triangle, the square, and a circle, equivalent to the pentagon defined above. Special values Steinhaus defined, mega is the number equivalent to 2 in a circle, megaston is the number equivalent to 10 in a circle, Moses number is the number represented by 2 in a megagon, where a megagon is a polygon with mega sides. Alternative notations, use the functions square and triangle, let m be the number represented by the number n in m nested p-sided polygons, then the rules are, and mega equals megaston equals moser equals, mega, a mega, is already a very large number, since equals square, equals square, equals square, equals square, equals square, equals square, equals triangle, 256 triangles, equals triangle, 255 triangles, tilde triangle, 254 triangles, equals, using the other notation, Mega equals m equals m with the function we have mega equals where the superscript denotes a functional power, not a numerical power. We have m equals m equals similarly m m etc. Thus, mega equals where denotes a functional power of the function. Rounding more crudely, we get mega using the superarrow notation. After the first few steps, the value of is each time approximately equal to. In fact, it is even approximately equal to. Using base 10 powers we get mega equals where denotes a functional power of the function. Hence, Moses number. It has been proven that in Conway chain arrow notation and in Nuthsup arrow notation, therefore, Moses number, although incomprehensibly large, is vanishingly small compared to Graham's number.